apples, 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 apples. How are we going to get this Mac to play these games? Got to find a way. Look, um, look, if we took if we took applesauce and massaged it into some graphics cards, you know, sort of a maybe a shiatsu style uh, uh, application of applesauce. Uh, no, I don't think so, Tiny. Uh, okay. Uh, what if what what if we uh, hypnotized a few video cards and we we actually got the video cards to believe that they had become uh, Granny Smith or Fuji apples, to, you know, sort of. Uh, get the most performance out of the graphics card now. Video cards can't be hypnotized. We don't, we don't know that for sure yet. Um, what if, ah, here we go. We bake, uh, we bake some GPUs into an apple pie, and uh, maybe like a Dutch apple pie with a cinnamon crumble on top, and, and then uh, let it dry overnight. Uh, no, wait. Uh, wow, what? I got it. What if, what if we could find a passing stranger, just happened to be moseying through, that had these genius intellect and, 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 and an amazing technical aptitude that could point us in the right direction. That would, would that be something if there was such a... Such and where a are we supposed to find this guy? I don't know. Usually when you're thinking about stuff like this, they, they just appear. But gosh, if there was somebody like that, I could... Heard you all were having some trouble taming this year, Apple. Shane! 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 Well, turns out I went ahead and made you a 285. Works just fine on the Mac. Y'all can have it. Oh, God, I love passing strangers. And with special thanks to Shane, I was able to get my new Mac Pro system up and running with a brand new EVGA graphics card. So let me show you how I did it. Before installing this graphics card, make sure that you install the drivers that are located on the CD included inside the package. After you have done that, you want to power off your machine and install the graphics card into the slot like I have done so here. You can see that the EVGA GTX 285 is right there. It also, also included inside the box are two power dongles. These plug into the, the uh, motherboard there and plug into the graphics card. This is to provide power to your brand new GTX 285. And once you do that, you power up the machine and you should be good to go. So now with this new graphics card installed, I'm able to play games like Call of Duty 4 on my Mac Pro in the native operating system with all the options maxed at 2560 by 1600 and I'm running over 100 frames per second. So it certainly is a very nice performance boost for, for gaming and also for other applications as well. So there you have it. Thanks again for watching. For more information on this product, please visit our website at www.evga.com or be a part of our community at forums.evga.com. If you have a question, send me one at jacobf.evga.com. Thanks again, and I will see you next time.